welcome back to Access. My name's Nathan. I'm here with Holly. What? what? Here being PSX. What are you doing in the director, Holly? Uh, I am taking you to go sparrow racing. What? That was You actually had to start this game. So I did. We, so, I was the fire so team leader. So you couldn't show off by going really slowly. But that was if you want to rewind the video, that's where you can find it. In yeah, the it's going to be down there where you'll do your nightfalls and you see what your daily is and all that lot. So. so this is us about to jump into... This is Venus, right? I believe we're going down to Venus, one of the two locations for tracks uh, for sparrow racing. Yeah. Uh, and the reason we're watching your video instead of mine is that I literally forgot the controls for so sparrows. I didn't do particularly well in my first race. I did a bit better on my second race, but on my first race, I think I came last, which is annoying because I would played against Deej, the Bungie community manager, yeah, I a that. race before. I actually came third you blew after blew, blowing up, blowing up Deej by knocking him off the track. Yeah. So, so Well, in this race, mm. I was sixth after the first lap because I was doing so incredibly badly. Yes. I actually finished third. Because I caught up, but I, the only reason I caught up is because I had, uh, you know, I had like a clear run because there was no one around to. Oh, look how cool this looks. To mess me up. We were talking about how much like wipeout it looks. I think that's like, amazing kind of as well. Yeah, I'm really aesthetically. I think it's so cool. In fact, I'm actually sitting here in the Sparrow Racing T-shirt because I love the design. Like the, the construction, like just a lot of the visuals of it look like that old kind of. Sick. Yeah, uh, the northern. Game of Republic kind of stuff. Yeah, it looks, it looks awesome. Yeah. Um, so here we are on board. SRL gates. Uh, these are kind of the boost gates, which form the... This is the kind of the main strategic... Oh, look at that. Just like el elbowing people out the way. I love it. The beginning... This is not... Right. There we go. Not my finest moment. Why? Someone tweeted me and um, was like, are sparrows as flippy as they normally are? Because I can flip a sparrow. Well, like that's obviously tomorrow. what you were testing. Uh, I was testing it right for there. the sake of this video. And actually, they're not... They don't feel as flippy. They control exactly like you look Sparrow controls. Racing ones are, they are slightly modified, aren't they? Yeah, slightly modified for racing, but you can go in with like your regular Sparrows. So if you have quite a good Sparrow that you've got already, you can actually use that in the racing. If not, Amanda will be selling you or giving you something a little bit better. Yeah. Especially if you're still on like the original Sparrow. So I'm behind you at this point. That's uh, that's when I think that's pretty much where I'm at until near this the end. This is genuinely a diabolical run. Well, this is our very first go and it is, it is a completely different mode to, to get your, you know, your, your brain around. So these gates, they kind of shrink very slightly every time you use them. So the race gets harder, you know, the the, the more you're on top of kind of- You need them. Smashing through them, yeah. Like you genuinely need them. Um, look at that, I'm ricocheting. That is disgusting sparrow behavior. Bear in mind, all of this time, I have literally, I'm trying to use the wrong stick and I'm just smashing into every wall, like I'm collecting them. So as bad as you think your footage looks, my footage is the one that we literally couldn't use. So. Uh, yeah. But it's really cool. So um, as you're going through, you'll notice that the Taken are out um, and you can kind of bash people as well. So your Sparrow does take damage. Yes. Um, if it takes damage, you will blow up. And I do I think up. I demonstrate that also in this footage. Yeah, I blew up in the in the next race just by hitting stuff. So when I was playing against Deej originally, um, someone tried to dismount from their Sparrow and you automatically blow up if you dismount from like your that. Sparrow. Doesn't and it like turns it. out, no, you can't. You know, like at the beginning where you're all like bunged up, if you dismount then, no, it does not damage everybody yeah, else. Yeah, because <laughs> we've checked. One of, the, one of the other guys from Bungie was saying that it, as, a, as a, a ruse, he was trying to get off his sparrow at the beginning to blow everybody else it up. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. Uh, no, it does not. Um, but one thing you can do is if you hit uh, L1 or R1, or I believe L3 or R3. I think it's L3, but in, in either direction. Yeah, so if you hit L, you're bumping to the left. If you're hitting R, you're bumping to the right. Yeah. Uh, and this is actually like knock people out. So it's like a shunt. Yeah, yeah and you can you can knock them straight. I did this Deej, the Bungie Community Manager, and literally knocked him off the track and he blew up. And I was like, suck it, Deej. I think this is one of the things which is hard to tell from this footage. But uh, and, and obviously, I didn't really get it in this first race because I was so far behind everyone. And, and then the crowd was thinned out by the time I caught up. But um, those that first lap, the yeah. the struggling for position is so like and the, and the gates are pretty narrow and it's very easy to uh, to knock people off course and and I ha I hadn't got quite to grips with how the physics worked and you know exactly what position I needed to be in in order to jostle for the for the right kind of right racing line um, it is tough it's going to be a whole new skill that yeah it's going to be interesting because. Obviously, as you're racing, you're getting um, points, just like you do when you're doing your bounties and you're getting like your Vanguard points. And you can get bounties for this as well. So you'd be able to go to Amanda and pick up uh, bounties for when you're racing. Nice. And these obviously give you more points and upgrade you. And then obviously you can get your Sparrow to be much, much better, much faster. That's me. That's me, by the way. Yeah, that's finally, me. That's how bad I'm doing. Finally sorting myself out and, uh, yeah. and, and 
And, Look at uh, that. It's just diabolical racing. But I did get the three gates at once. But then I just took that corner really wide and it didn't matter. So. I think maybe you overtake me at the end, actually. I don't think I do, Nathan. Oh, okay. Someone does. I think I came third. But look, I was in second for a bit, and I was like, maybe I'm not so bad after all. Uh, and then I was quite bad. And it's certainly in the second race, yeah. And then I'm yeah. like, there's a lot of glimmer riding on this, and I'm like... Oh, not for me, this not. Not for me, he hasn't. That's pretty tragic. So look at that. Absolutely. I always take corners really poorly on my Sparrow. Yeah, do you, well... Do you know, one of the things about coming to shows and playing games for the first time is that you're putting yourself out there going like, I haven't practiced this for hours. This is just what it looks like when someone has their first go. Oh, no, all I play is Destiny. Like, well, I really true. should have been better. Maybe. What, uh, then, well, then what's my excuse for literally... Well, you overtook me. Controls? That is true. Yeah, that's right. Maybe I think I'm this fine. is where I die. Ooh, Boom. okay. Now well, look well, how can... cool this is. Look at that screen. That's, that's, that's mobile the same phone wallpaper. That's right the same there. design you've got on your t shirt. Yeah, that's that mobile phone right wallpaper. Um, I love the emblem. I've had a Jade Rabbit on my, on my emblem forever. Like, I've never switched out from Jade Rabbit, the, but I think I might for the Sparrow Racing League one. It's real pretty. The t shirts were supposed to be for winners that's only. Right. And, uh, yeah, but it yeah. turns out if you just ask really nicely. And Holly and I both have them. I've got, I got one for Little Big Oki. Really? Yeah, uh -huh. he's actually babysitting more consoles channel, or more consoles out here with us. So, um,. I got Oki a t-shirt. That's the way to keep the community happy. So here's you coming in fifth. By knocking into a wall. Yeah, that wall didn't know what hit Yeah, it. so what happens when you cross the line then, you get uh, a few seconds till the race ends. So if you're in last and you're still racing, it'll give you 25 seconds to like, physically cross the line. You can then see what position, your time, and um, your hit. And then obviously you'll get some loot. I got Motes of Light. I do love Motes of Light. And then moving on to the second race. Yeah, because we'll show some of the like the loot you can get after this one. But yes. we then did the second course, which is on Mars. Campus Martius. Um, yeah. So you see those turbines? Yeah, they, they were not my friend. Uh, I got hit by one, I think, as well. One of them basically, well, I got, I hit it. I kind of got stuck on it. It started dragging me up into the sky, and then I exploded. Look how cool my sparrow is. My sparrow has electricity. My sparrow. This is mine, right? Incredible. The pink one is me. You're the pink one, yeah the garish pink, uh, fizzing pink. Don't joke, I think someone gets that shader as a drop at the end Get of this. Um, it's the kind of shaders you find in, for like doing the Queen's bounties. Like fondant fancy shader, so that's what it should be called. Yeah, it's um, yeah, it's a bunch of rank three stuff. So this this is a good example of the stuff I was talking about, you know, like just Look everyone. Look at that, see, Well, actually, got... you've got absolutely munched, but the, um, yeah. but you can see kind of what, uh, what a, like it's like insects crawling on each other it's yeah. like a real kind of fight for life so when i started this one i had my hands in a different place on the controller thinking maybe i could have uh really quick access to uh i was trying L1 to, that. And R1 yeah, to, yeah. to bench. and i just actually found that it was a really uncomfortable way and then i it spent ages just repositioning my hands every now and again when i go across like a large section of the map just in in regular destiny on my on my uh, sparrow like yeah i shift down one finger onto L2 and then I have like my so like my middle fingers on L2 and then my index finger is supposedly for bumping but uh, yeah it does it makes it harder to race it turns out my thumbs were like I'm not sure about this new arrangement of fingers and, yeah, and therefore exactly and me. therefore I betray you yeah so I this like I had gone back now to having like just a basic grip on the controller and I was just doing a bit better and I was like okay I need to find a different way to do some bumping so but, do you know after my practice. comeback in the first race I was like well now I know what now I've remembered which thumbstick I should be using of course I'm going to win and actually I did not win no uh, but what I quite like here is if you look in the bottom left corner, you can see how fast I'm going and what's obviously flashing red. Like when we normally use our specials, like grenades, and for me, I'm a titan, so I just punch everything. Mm. Um, this is the same. So if you use your bumper, yeah. uh, you then have to wait for it to recharge. So you literally can't run around just hitting the bumper button and hoping. That's beautiful. Because I was, that I was using bumpers basically to realign myself with the gates. Um, and I, yeah, I was overusing it massively. Like, yeah. so, uh, rather than actually racing the racing line, I was trying to just shunt my way everywhere. Uh, yeah, that's not smart. So this is excellent racing right here. You're second to... This guy won the first race, I think, and he yeah. had he was basically very good. This is a much nicer race. But again, you can see I'm taking damage there. And if you were just have not smart, like, see, and I missed a couple of gates. You did, but do you know what reminds me so much of uh, Wipeout again is that when you're in the clear and you have a clear run at the gates, it actually becomes much easier. Like, you can just concentrate on actually racing rather yeah. than fighting. It's that kind of the combat racing really does make it so difficult to, to get out ahead. That's why, that's why the guy in front is doing so well. You know what this reminds me of? Uh, Goran racing in Majora's Mask. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> it's a really like out there thing, but just all that like shuffling in like a sandy area. Anyway, um, yeah, I, we all ended up bunched up again around here, and again, you can just see how aggressive it is actually for a racing game. Like you really this is, see, look at that, absolutely put up the wall there, and, and then. But, and you also like, I don't know how you can go. I mean, obviously, once we once we've done a bunch of races, everyone's going to learn exactly how to jostle for position like yeah. that. But I don't know what you did wrong there. You know what I mean? Should you be shunting into the crowd to stop I yourself? I probably from... should have fought back. I got shunted. I should have been just as aggressive, and I wasn't. Yeah. Um, but that's a lot. Like next time, I'll be way more as aggressive. Titan nastiness that I'm so good at displaying. At least they aren't full on. You know, like. Yeah, I got oh, hit okay. that, but it didn't take me, so I just. Yeah. Mine was worse. So having a good day. Is that me? I can't even remember what I was. I don't remember being second in this race. To be honest. Probably not. Uh, I think I get quite a good run here actually as well, and again it just makes a di it makes such a massive difference. See like that. That's See look at that. Oh. Look at that is, and then that means yeah. that person's completely left that's me in the dust. They took me out the gate, went for it themselves, and then they have just left me behind. And it's so like in other racing games, you know, there might be like a speed boost that you get or like a, a remote weapon that you can fire. And on this is like the feeling of being behind someone, and if they hit their gates, they're just gonna stay. Then you know yeah. they take their corners well, they're gonna stay ahead of you. It's a yeah, super frustrating feeling. Um, so at the moment, they don't think there's matchmaking. He, well, there's matchmaking, sorry. So you can go in with friends. So like, I could just take my raid team in. Yeah. Or I could be matchmade if okay. it's just me on my own. Um, but what they haven't got at the moment is like a skill matchmaking. So if I am new and I have quite a low level Sparrow, I right. could end up with people with really high level Sparrows. Right, gotcha. But you know, you're still going to get some rep and reward no matter what you do. get some modes of light. It's fine. Oh, I love modes of light. Relax, well, everybody. Modes of light are great when you've just got yourself a, a brand new toy and you just want to go play Level with it. Up, yeah, yeah exactly. Gonna, I'm going to eat all my modes of light. Exactly. Oh, my, 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 my. oh, look, number one's been slowed down by that, uh, yep. like that stasis field thing. This is me. I mean, I think I was in the... No, 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 there I am having a good day. Still doing this all right is it, this This point. is where I pull away now. If you could check behind... Yeah, this you've done well. Awesome. I get stuck this is it. on this turbine. I'm off. Oh, you're so close. Take your lead. I take this gate oh. and then I think I get a really sweet run from here. We should stop the video here. Yeah, <laughs> we really should because this is where I'm like. Oh man. I am just swearing blind. Was the. Uh, behind me was as well. The, was this, the, the pressure This help. is it now, yeah. I missed three gates in a row. So he's done so well. Yeah, I missed three gates and oh. that was it. And then I went down from first to, la uh, to third and yeah, here's the finish line. Oh man, yeah, but that was close. That was really, really, really gutting for me. Uh, Look, uh, look, you look you, I might, you look, I might have slammed my I didn't controller realize, down. Uh, yeah, I knew you threw it because I remember it, but I didn't realize it actually disconnected. So was, <laughs> yes, okay. <laughs> I, a little bit frustrated after uh, dropping the F bomb, I then sort of threw my controller on the floor, and this happened. I so, think that the people from Bungie were like, "That was yeah, well done for having a tantrum. That's that's really cool." Uh, yeah. So what it's doing now is just like letting everyone finish up the race, uh, and then I think we're going to show you like some of the loot we got because yeah. everyone loves. Uh, you know, you have to pray to RN Jesus. Let's have a let's, let's take a look. So here are the rewards. Look at the emblems. They're so cool. Yeah. So um, we had a few bits here on Venus. Uh, now I'm looking at this. And I don't think the defense levels are right. <laughs> I no. think that Bungie are going to change those. But. Yeah, yeah, it seems so. Otherwise, I'm never doing any racing. Uh, but so, yeah. Cr well, Crash Hammer, maybe it's for racing only. But no, because the perks are obviously Yeah, for look at the perks. There are uh, their perks. A little bit of mo motes of light and obviously a few bits of blue because we have to have a few blues. So what would you have won? You'd have won a blue chest piece. That's what you could have won, Holly. I just need legs, Nathan. <laughs> you just, yeah. You were asking everyone from Bungie, can you get me some, some legs? Oh my God, 295 legs. legs. Orange Jesus is, he well, hates where me. Are, where are my legs? So this is the rewards from the other race that we can this see This is here. cool. So here we saw some really, really cool stuff. So anti-corn. Yeah. So obviously your Sparrow is going to be able to, I mean, beep, beep. Dukes of Hazard maybe. Uh, Look at Karacha. Or I'm out. Um, but yeah, so basically where your emotes are, and I think I show this a little bit later on, but where your emotes are, that changes to horns. Oh, okay. So you can change ah, horns. Ah, so maybe you could have lots of horns. Uh, this is obviously a racing specific uh, bond for the warlock. Uh, uh, totally. Look at that, Hell the, the Jade, Jade Rabbit. Rabbit. You're a Jade Rabbit fan. Um, I love the emblem, but um, I um, actually switched between Red Death and No Time to Explain. I just got Jade Rabbit, but the clip size is too small. I have a real spray and pray attitude. And there's also a shader up here as well. Midnight Lumos, that's actually the one you're wearing, because I had a little look 
uh, on when I was playing on a different console and I had both options. I had a really nice black shader. So they didn't take my suggestion of calling it the Fond and Fancy shader? No, they didn't. That's a shame. Um, there's a, a couple of different horns and then obviously there's some stuff there. You can have fun with the Cryptarch. Um, so I had a quick look in the menu as well because I wanted to give you a real idea of how different the Sparrow suits look from what we're used to seeing. Very tight trousers. Love tight trousers. Uh, but here we are. So... Um, I'm having a look at this one. So we've got the racer's scarf, which looks really, really cool. Kind of reminds me of kind of, you know, like someone in the 1930s on a motorbike, <laughs> scarf billowing behind. All your rivals will see your contrails. Uh, boots of the Jade Rabbit. Interesting. So this is a whole different, yeah. So leg armors obviously look different. Now I've tried, you can't shoot people. But here we are. So I don't have any other shaders to use. Uh, sign of momentum. I'm wondering if that's your license that you get, because you have to obtain a license before ah, you can I start fire racing. So okay. I'm wondering if it's a bit like um, Iron Banner, where you have to have the Iron Banner thing, yeah, yeah, your yeah. emblem I on. I, I wonder if you have to have that on. And here it is. How pretty is that arc the runner? Arc oh runner. my god. All of the items that Bungie make always look very nice and that is no exception that is no exception uh, i was really happy with that and there i am with my happy horn <laughs> blow your horn tight trousers and your happy horn <laughs> and that's where we'll leave holly for now so that is your first look at sparrow racing league uh, so don't forget to subscribe to Access because we've got loads more coming up, not just from the PlayStation experience, uh, but other lovely things before Christmas as well. Say goodbye, Holly. Bye.